is becoming a very crowded race for the mayor's chair. Two more heavyweights will make their bids official in a matter of hours. John Tory stopping by Breakfast Television just a few minutes ago. After announcing he will take another run at the mayor's chair, he told me what we can expect from his campaign. I am going to run a race that's about the future, that's about ideas to build a livable, affordable, functional city to get the government working again with people working with each other, working with other governments, getting transit built, uh, as opposed to getting bogged down in anything else. I want to be positive and about the future, and that's what I'm going to do, uh, and others will have to see. But I, I, I'm, I'm, I am who I am, and that's the kind of campaign I'm going to run. Tory promising that a downtown relief line is a priority. And now, enter the next candidate, uh, our little uh, sunflower here. Now, you brought your sunflowers. I did. Your yes. trademark sunflowers. These are my trademark here. sunflowers. There you go. Uh, Thank I'm just going to gonna put them over here because it's, like yeah. it's like being at a <laughs> restaurant here, and I can't see you. So I'm just going to move, move them on over here. Sounds good. Um, did you see John at all? Uh, no, we miss each other. You miss each other. Wait, but I'm what, sure I'm going to see him. I'm what, on the trail. You, what would you have had? I just want to make sure these don't yeah. fall. Okay. What would you have said to him? Congratulations. Yeah. yeah, you know what? It's a great city, and I know I'm excited about the campaign ahead and um, looking forward to engaging Torontonians about the issues that matter to them. So we, well, we knew you were coming in this morning. We knew yeah. last week. We knew you were going to be uh, officially uh, putting your name in today. Yeah. What, did, did, did it miff you at all that John Tory oh, snuck no. in there as well and nah. he's, he's going to upstage you a bit? <laughs> no. no, no, no. Are you kidding? It's a campaign. It's a okay. mayor campaign. It's going to be a long campaign. It's, you know what, though? It's a great one. It's yeah. going to be good because, um, you know, the people of Toronto, they've said pretty clearly that they want a leader who is responsible and accountable and focusing on their priorities. And so being at City Hall for 10 years and living in the city and having the same priorities, I'm really looking forward to getting out and, uh, and talking to the people about how to make the city as great as it can be. What's job number one? Job number one, again, is to deal with congestion, but, uh, you know, and it's more than just transit, cause, because congestion is about transit, cars, bikes, deliveries, vans, taxis, so it's, you know, helping deal with congestion so people can get home quicker. It's about making sure we're building safe neighborhoods, and it is, it is about making sure that our tax rates are affordable. How, how do you go up against a candidate like Rob Ford? That is a very strong candidate. He has an incredible <laughs> grassroots level. I mean, anybody who can stick yeah. with him through everything that has happened over the last yeah. few months, they, they're, not gonna, they're not gonna move away from him very easily. How do you sway that grassroots support that he has, that well, you're the person? Well, the people that I talk to, and you know, and I go around the city, and I've been on council for 10 years, and the people that I talk to are saying that they do. They want a responsible, accountable leader, and uh, someone who's fiscally responsible with their money, but also can get things done. And so that's the mayor that I want to be, and that's the campaign I'm going to run. The council itself. Yes. I mean, this has been a, a divided council. Yeah. Uh, it has been a beat-up council. Yeah. What What do you do <laughs> in November? We have had some interesting circumstances. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Interesting, yeah. That's one word you, you could use for yes. it. But what do you do in November to yeah. change that? Well, you know, I've worked with my colleagues, and we've got a lot of things done. We got, we got money for a subway. We got a transit plan through. We've made some really important decisions for the city. And so my view is that when, um, you know, when I get elected mayor and I come to the council and say, here's the plan that's going to help improve the quality of life for everyone who lives in the city, that it's not going to be hard to get support for that plan. I'm concerned that we could see this campaign degrade yeah. into probably one of the dirtiest campaigns that, that this city has seen. I, I, I'm just fearful of that. What, how, what do yeah. you see in this ca yeah, upcoming you know, campaign? I see people that are really engaged in the city in a way that they've never been before. And so I look forward to a campaign about ideas and a campaign about making sure people understand that City Hall can work for them. Because that's what's been missing for the last little while. There's been a desire to get a responsible mayor that um, you know we, we haven't seen one. And so now I think is the time to step up and say, you know what? We're a, we're a big city, a global city, a responsible city that needs a responsible mayor. Okay, now you tweeted out a picture of you. You filled out your forms on the I weekend. Did. But I you did. haven't signed them I yet. I didn't. So, no, if you have a pen, I, Kevin, I'd love to borrow Great. your pen so that I can make this official. Um, <laughs> see, I usually, I usually do all, take all my notes on my <laughs> iPhone. <laughs> and I, uses a pen these And I don't days. know if we even have a pen anywhere in the newsroom. Oh, thank you, awesome. Andy. Awesome. Thank there you. There we go. Thank you. So, so. this is... This is 
So this is, I will hand this in. I think, um, I'm not going to wait in line because I think, you know, I think Tori's there now, but at 10 o'clock, I'm taking yeah. those in and I will officially be on the ballot October 27th. The nomination paper. That's what My, you're going you're to yes. hand into the clerk that's later on that's today. Correct. All right. Well, I wish you well in your campaign. You and I much. hope things do not degrade yeah. as I'm fearful they might. No. And uh, I wish you and, and all the candidates good luck. Thank you very much. All right. Karen good to see you. Joining us. Let's go upstairs. Here's Russ Holden, the traffic center. Okay, Kevin. And uh, still